Hey everyone, in this video what we're going to be doing is removing this old service cable. Uh, it goes overhead to our utility pole, uh, which I already ran uh, for the back house here. We ran underground this way. Now we're going to go underground for this house and we're going to be going underground. All right here. Uh, so really uh, first thing we need to do is mark out and make sure we're not going to dig up anything That's important. I already know our water line comes from the other side of the house So we don't need to worry about that and this is obviously overhead but like I said from that pole uh, Goes about here is our underground for the other house um so I gotta be really careful and really examine when I start digging out over there to make sure I, I see that. I wanna see it. So I wanna uh, scrape some dirt off and dig it out by hand so I see it and I know exactly where it is so that I can avoid it and then dig here. Uh, so let's get, let's get the machine and start digging. Okay, we got some digging done here. Uh, came as close to the house as I could without knocking a hole in the house and I had to do the rest by hand here all that by shovel uh, and then dug it out we got at least three feet of depth um, and we will be in a uh, conduit a plastic conduit all right, so I got all that done now down closer to the uh, to the pole there I wanted to stay away from the existing power going to the other house so I came that way, then I had to tuck it in, so I probably have to put a nice little eighth bend on that. Not a big deal. So, uh, and I went and picked up the wire, and all the material, and so let's get laying that in. Okay, now that our hole is dug, trench rather, excuse me, now we're ready to start laying our wire down. Right, we're not gonna just uh, put our conduit together make it all look nice and all that, then shove the wire in. No, no, no. That would be a big mistake. What we're gonna do, we're gonna get the conduit, we're gonna lay it all down in there. We're gonna get, make sure it's all good and everything, and we're gonna start sliding it over the wire to whatever end we wanna start from. Take a pick, the house or the pole. Uh, I'm gonna choose the house, because that's usually we need a little bit more finesse. Maybe, okay, whatever. Um, important thing, we're going underground, okay? So it doesn't matter, like this house here, I'd be lucky if it has a 100 amp panel in it right now. I really don't know what it is. I think it's more like a 75. It's as old as dirt. Like the very first breaker panel, I'm sure this house had it, and still has it, but we're taking all that out. This is all going 200 amp. But regardless, a lot of people don't get this. We got the wire here. The wire is a 4 op which means 200 amp service. Underground, going in conduit. No matter what, if it's going underground, you're going 4 op 200 amp. Doesn't matter what kind of panel you have going, doesn't matter. Underground code is a 4 op wire. We're using a 2 inch uh, conduit. We, yeah, we can go 3 inch, 4 inch, whatever, but not necessary 2 inch perfect size okay so let's start laying this in and gluing it all together and all that good stuff all right well this is going to be a little on the difficult side because i got a i don't have a camera in so we're going to keep the camera uh on a tripod i'm going to get the wire now when i measured the wire i went i gave it uh, plenty of extra to the house you mean the meter pan plenty of extra uh and i gave it a ton of extra at the pole and I can't the tape measure you know doesn't really work going straight up to the top of the pole to where it needs to go so uh, I did as best I can I guesstimated I uh, left a little extra because if you're short I mean <laughs> you got a problem right? as you're gonna see today we're gonna put all this wire in we're gonna fill it in pack it down all that done deal okay so, uh, you want to be cheap on wire? Now's not the time. So, I'm going to start laying this wire out. It's real heavy. It's, uh, you got to, you know, really, 
not just not easy laying it down I'm gonna get it to where I, uh, I want it and then we're gonna I'm gonna start putting the uh, the conduit one piece at a time and gluing it as, as I go down uh, so uh, instead of this video taking uh, an hour for me to do it probably just gonna um, speed it up so enjoy the ride Right, here we are uh, I buried uh, the wire after inspection now don't forget it don't forget to get this inspected I backfilled all this you can see I got a, uh, a schedule 80 pipe going up uh, where the schedule 80 uh, it's extra thick uh, plastic conduit going up there and I got another piece laying next to it so when the utility company comes to connect this they'll uh, use that other pipe there and go if you can see the other two inch uh, that's for the other house uh, be the same way and they'll connect it all up there hopefully I'm able to get that on video but back to over here where I left this oops <laughs> almost fell left this open to show you a few things one uh, you notice my red ribbon tape there what you do you backfill about a foot over your your conduit right and then you get this and it, it it says right on it you know electrical be uh be careful because you're about to die uh so you can put about a dirt a foot or more above your uh on top of your conduit and then just lay this on top of that and throw the dirt over so uh if and when somebody's digging in the area and they see that they should pretty much uh know hey <laughs> you better stop or be really careful okay so let's see what we got here ran all our pipe the uh the one inch over here that's just for our cable tv we have our slip joint in here now what is a slip joint okay well here's what it is this ground here i mean it's virgin soil still i only dug to the depth but uh suppose this was a new house and had uh, uh, set a lot more settling can really happen and what happens is with all the weight of this dirt on top of this, uh, it's going to push that pipe down. It's going to sink down with everything else. And it will essentially pull the meter right off the house. So the slip joint, what it does, uh, it will slip. You know, these two pieces, they, they, uh, this piece is inside this and it, it, they slide. It actually has grease in it too. So this will pull down separately, uh, bringing the wire with it. But with that, you see, right now I just got the wire sticking out like that, right? But the wire, when I go to wire this, I gotta loop this around. So it has that room so the wire could actually uh, pull without pulling everything off. I mean, it only works so well until uh, then it will just take it right off the house. So now we get to wire the whole new panel inside. 